Hello YouTube, I wanted to make this video about uh, this pump assisting my uh, chemical rinse. Um, so basically the way that I have it set up is that my five gallon tank here with rinse and this is the hose, it comes through a filter and it comes to this pump right here. Um, then the pump, the line goes down to the metering block on the bottom and the top of the metering block goes to my pressure pump here, okay? Now, the beauty of this is that the problem that I was having with this setup um, before, I, before I put this um, pump was that my metering well, will be all over the place. Um, you will set it at two and it will be between two and three and four and sometimes it will just be all over the place. By adding this pump here, now if I set it at two, it stays at two. If I need three, four metering, it stays at that because of this pump. Again, um, it comes from the five gallon tank through a filter, okay? This is the filter right here, to the pump, straight down to the bottom of the metering block. And the top of the metering block goes straight to my pressure pump, okay? My pressure pump goes through here. Also, I wanted to mention that, if, for example, um, this is a very low amperage pump. So I, anytime I activate my pump here, my clutch, to activate the pressure, um, so that when that's on, this is on. Now the beauty of this is that it has a very low amperage, and I'm gonna get a little closer. Um, by the way, I bought this pump at Amazon if you want to pause it and, and look at it. The beauty of this is that if I don't want to use the rinse, all I got to do is just close the line. All right. If by closing the line, the pump will build pressure and it will stop. All right. You open the line back up and the pump starts um, working again. So being low amperage, you don't have to worry about you know, the pump draining your battery, etc. And I just wanted to make this video because if you're having the problem where your metering is all over the place, um, think about adding one of these pumps. I think it will help you a lot. Um, and it's very easy and very inexpensive. Also, um, if you have a different type of pump, pressure pump, it works as well because all you need to find out is where your uh, siphon is, hook the line to it, and this pressure and this pump would assist that to bring the rinse in your uh, your pressure pump. So it doesn't matter what pump you have. This would assist and will help you bring the rinse inside. All right, and also will help you. You know have that metering, you know, you know, set correctly. I think it's a very good investment. Um, and I hope this helps. Uh, I met a wonderful, uh, you know, a lot of wonderful carpet cleaners and I have called many of them and help out and stuff like that. And like I said, I don't think I'm the first one doing this. Um, I just wanted to share it how I have it. And for me, it works the best. Uh, Thanks for watching. This is Pavel from Jacksonville, Florida. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.